The first day of school is in the books now. For another round of students, COVID protocols are in place. Melita Union School District kicked off its school year today, and News Channel 3 Scott Sheehan stopped by Elwood Elementary to see what precautions are in place there. <laughs> Kids flooded into Elwood Elementary for their first day of school. This is my first day in a really long time having a first day of school. About 3,300 students in Goleta Union School District started Wednesday. For many, it's their third school year impacted by the pandemic. But for others, it's their first day of school ever. He uh, extremely excited the last few days. Uh, this morning, he, I think he was up by six before anyone ready to go. Um, and then as soon as we got here and we dropped him off, that's when the waterworks started and he was just not ready to depart from his parents. Yeah, yeah new friends? You're just gonna wear your mask today, right? Okay. School district faculty members are required to get a vaccine or tested weekly. Students and staff must wear masks indoors and try to maintain physical distancing. Like that and that six feet, okay? Staffers say they're more comfortable heading into this year after distancing and some in-person learning last year. We just learned how to really get into protocols last year. Kids washing hands, they wash their hands all the time uh, and they're really good at it. Uh, we're wearing masks in class and we follow the public health guidelines and we had a really good safety record last year and we're really looking to just continue that this year. Both teachers and students are happy to be back. Cool. Right. In Goleta, Scott Sheehan, News Channel 3.